Who would have predicted that today after everything what's happened? Well, I've never seen the tide this high here. We stopped here last night at Kemlin. And it is the most fabulous morning. It's a bit cooler. It dropped off cool last night, but... Is that for the view to wake up to? <laughs> and I have just not only walked me. <laughs> Guess what's going to happen in the? How much water do you need? Oh no! He's spraying it for breeze. Oh my god, that is about to become the chamber of horrors. <laughs> Toilet, check. Regina, check. <laughs> Lid, check. <coughs> what are you going to do with that? Can you take it to Bert Maris or something for us? Oh yeah, I'll tell you what, I'll take it on. <laughs> oh my god. It's like two loops. Right the bottom. Cumberland sausage. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh shit. I say. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Landwin Island. That wind's got up. What direction is that now, westerly? It's changed 100 de 180 degrees from this morning. I've come over here. Oh. You'll never beat the wind, will you? I forgot how bad of a pull down it was there in that soft sand. It's an absolute nightmare. As usual, when you try and second guess the weather, you've no chance. It was blowing easterly on the other side of the island before. I come down here, it's blowing westerly. You just try and guess, second guess it. You just try, you just do your best. This weather's gone like this in the last hour. I was going to walk down from where I was parked and have a look at the sea state. And it was still sunny then when I set off. And it's just come in within that, less than an hour. It's unbelievable. I don't know, and I just won't bothered. That cross and them ruins really gives it a mysterious feel this place. I think they are genuine, uh, it's all genuine ruins and that. This is Pilot's Cove. What has happened to this weather? Look, you can see it's still sunny over there. The other side of the island is sunny. And this side, where I decided to come. <laughs> see you in heaven if you make the grave. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I'm going to need my spray top on when I get round there. I would never have guessed that on sat on that car park half an hour ago. I love it here. Cracking spot. Come on, boy, what's going on? Well, I love it, sure. There, there's two of them. <laughs> All the yachties love it here. My God, there's some shallow water over there though. You've got to be careful. You've got to go right out there. Especially if you're in a yacht. With a thin keel on it, you will run aground. 
the creaking going on with these yachts. boat station or pilot boat station there's the other one how long is it since I've been here now can't remember the GPS is showing you that I am right there next to that beacon not bad is it not bad the sea conditions are about to take Turn for the worse. Look at it. Well, that looks like the sum total of my day. 1.28 miles. I can't see any point going any further in that, can you? I put my spray top on and I was gonna um, give it a go and brave it, but what's the point? There's no fun in that for me. I'm only doing it for fun. I've not proved to anybody. I'm shite anyway, I'm not bothered. The only thing I can say is I'm a lot more comfortable in this boat, in this kind of stuff, than I was in the rock pool. Oh well, I'm going back shite to it. There you go, one and a half miles. What a great day. Still, it beats being at work, doesn't it? Well, I decided to go back. I've been round there talking with a fella on a boat for about half an hour or so. Might have been a bit longer. And in that time, it's flattened off. So it's back on again. <laughs> Who can work it out, eh? Here it is. Still a bit lumpy. Flattening off though. That wind's dropped now. Who can weigh it up? Could have done with some sunshine though. Shag rock. Up to the follow them. Fantastic place, this. Deserves a better day than this. Well. Willy, 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 willy. I was going to go right over there. It's a bit of a drag. And this. If the sea was flat, it wouldn't be half as bad. It's a bit of a drag. That. It's a bit of a drag back as well. We stopped there on that beach, had a butty. My bottle of milk was leaking. Oh, it's just been a disaster this trip. I'm going to nip over there. It's flattened off a lot. It's flattening off all the time. I'm going to nip over there and see how far I can get up this estuary. And it's one of them things I've always wondered about. I don't know why I've never tried it before. I'm assuming it's going to be a mile across. So what we're on now, 3.19 miles, 5.36, let's see how long it takes. That's a nice view through there, look at that. Just through the strip of land is separating Landwin Island from the mainland. Oh, it's flattened off beautifully now. It's just very, very light, uh, slight winds. I can hardly feel it. Another hour, this sea will be flat as tabletop. Let's go and have a look what's going on over here. I don't know if the camera can pick them up, but listen to them turns. There's loads of turns bickering.
Papa, Agwin! Agwin! Now then, get that for the view. That's nice, isn't it? The mountains in the background. The rifle there at the back. Sensational. Oh no, look, it's a gyre. It's a proper gyre. You know what a gyre is? A gyre is. Like an islands of rubbish in the Pacific, they reckon there's the 100, 100 miles square and full of all discarded plastic. Everything seems to collect. These turns are really going for it, I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know if they're mating or... This is Maltrith Sands. Usually a fair bit of surf on here. It's not so bad now, it's not, it's not very big like, but... I've been treated to an aerial display from the turns. Now I get every time I get the camera out, they go. They've been diving right in front of me, it's been good. Wow, look at that view behind me. What about that then? Not bad, is it? Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, it's really flattened off now, this sea. Now I'm going to try and find the entrance to this estuary here. It's somewhere over there, I can't see any hint of it at the moment. Notice this surf is building up. There must be a quite shallow reef here, look at them building up them swells. Probably a bar. Oh, what's going on? Skidded out to control it, focus. It's probably a sandbar. I think this is it now, the estuary to go into Maltrith. I've been coming here to Anglesey for pushing 30 years, 27 years, 26, 27 years, yeah. And I've never been here. This is a new one. There's Landwin Island where I've come from. Uh, what was it over there? 3.1. A mile and a half it was. I thought it would be a mile. So a mile and a half across the bay. You could surf on these waves. I don't know if I'm imagining it. If I can see the bottom here, it's, the water's not the clearest. Yeah, I can see the bottom. Only about three foot deep here. It's less than that. Look at these glassy waves. I might have a go at surfing on one of them. I managed one. Seven and a half miles an hour I got, I think 7.2. It is dead shallow here. It must dry out then, this at low water. It must do. I have absolutely no idea how far this goes in, how far you can go. The tide's rising now, so I should be able to get right up to the bridge at Maltai. This is actually, actually nice and peaceful. I've never seen one of them. What the hell is that? It's a partridge or something. Surely they don't come round by to see. Shut up, paddle. What the hell is that bird? It's like Roadrunner. Fish it shallows as well, look. And they beat me to it, look, this footprint's here. What the hell is that bird? <laughs> there, there's, there's one. There it is. It's a 
chicken. It's a bloody chicken. Is it a chicken that? There's a few of them. Must be from Farmer Giles's farm. Well, there's another. Surely they're not chickens. Are they? I don't know, aren't they? Look at this. I'm loving it. So peaceful. Can you see edge of a house there? Look. Wow, what a ball tall. Look at that. I can really get this ball to ball to over more than it got to. I can hold it steady there. It's right top tipping point there. Rock steady primary, rock steady secondary stability, absolutely fantastic this boat. Look at that there now, land an island. So I can just keep still. A mile and a half away it was. Whatever them birds are, there's about 20 of them here. They're so well camouflaged. I can see one, two, three. There's one there moving. There's three there in that shot. There's another three there. Four, five, six. I don't know what they are. Rhode Island Red. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say, I'll say. There's loads of them there, look at them. There's loads of them in that shot. That's it, tell everyone I'm here. You can't beat. A gentle bit of current like this, just helping you along. Wow. This is um Maltrace Sands and all that there is Newborough Warren it's all deliberately planted after what was it after war before war I can't remember just like ravens it's famous for ravens Autumn Watch did a, a thing on it in there. It's like Raven City in there. Oh, somebody's texting me Sparling Peace. I'm not interested. Well, I'm absolutely loving this. To go back side at Rock. Stop striking.
Even with birds up there as well, like trees. Jackdaws. Ravens, crows. All members of the Corvid family are represented. Present and correct, sir. Things happen for a reason. I wonder if it's a stroke, stroke of fate that I stopped talking. I was on my way back and I stopped talking to that fella in the boat. And then the wind dropped off. I shall be on my way home now. Just wish you could pick all these sounds up proper like I can hear them. I'm going to have to get a recorder. Look at that, there's just a vast expanse of sand. And Oh, it's going shallow here. Current's picking up and all. Spinning me round. Right round, right round. Better put that skeg up here. That skeg touches bottom while I'm going sideways. Can you imagine it? These crows aren't bothered here, lads. Eh? Oh, no. Listen to that silence, it's amazing. It wouldn't have been half as good before with that wind. I don't think there'd have been enough water anyway. I think this is going to be it shortly. Go where the current's running the fastest, it should scour. Look at that place, it's beautiful. Look at that. Heavenly light. That's where I've come from. My God, I can't believe how good it is down here. House like this. I think I'm going to turn back at this house here. I've come six miles. I cannot believe it. I've come six miles. That's six miles back. That's 12 miles. Alright, alright. We know. There's a boat moored here, so you must be able to get a... Obviously, high water. Look at that, what's all that about there, that little hut? Sounds really give it atmosphere. This 
fish jumping and everything. That looks like an egret, what's got up there. Wants to catch you. My god, that's not made a noise. That is a shock. Something in the micro light. Oh, the geese are coming in now, look at this. Oh, I missed the egret going up. Fish there, it's shallow. There, 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 I can see the fins sticking out of water. What the hell? It's come up again, that fish. Whatever it is. Another egret. Silly egret. Oh, I'm not into that noise from farmer. Sparling it. Still living there, look at that, with its own little gate at sea. I'm just nipping to sea, love. Alright, don't be long. Bloody hell. How oh, the other half live. Got to paddle back up there now against this current. I've come 6.38 miles. <laughs> We're off dead back. Seven minutes to seven. And I've got six and a half miles to go back. Hmm. I'll do this one day. I'll time it right with tide. So I get up there at the top and uh, it'll turn on me when I'm at the top. It's going to be a struggle going back against this current. Oh, that had to happen, didn't it? Okay, boom. Diddums. Should have seen that one coming. And fish are jumping again over there. They're not jumping I get there, they wait till I can see them at the distance. 100 yards away jumping. Must be barely near that farmer there, I can smell hay. It's nice that. What are all the birds waiting for? It's really mysterious that door though, it's as if it leads through a wall. Look at a fish jumping there. As if it leads through that wall into somewhere. Either that, it's just a bog. Well, who would have predicted that today after everything what's happened? Fantastic this morning. Garbage this afternoon. Windy, horrible. And uh, it's coming for good again. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. Boy, was I right about the farmer bale in here, look at that. Mr. Bale, it's called. That thing is throwing. That bale, oh God, I'm going backwards here. Cannot believe how much I've loved this trip been really good it started off an absolute disaster look at this guy in uh, in the micro light bloody hell no wonder I've been struggling look at that current go now that is absolutely amazing <laughs> Wow. Just a dead simple trip and it's just so good, so easy.
Love it. There's Landwin Island over there. Yeah, it's really piling in now, this tide. Yeah, look at that current there now. I've got to fight back against that. It's trying rain, actually. In fact, I don't think it's trying, I think it's succeeding. This little pool here. It's like a little offshoot of the main current here. I don't know if the camera can pick them up, it's absolutely full of little gobies. No, they're not moved. Yeah, look at them all. I don't know if you can pick them up. There's hundreds of them. Here's the ravens. Need to get out of here now, quick, because it seems to be picking up this uh, current. It definitely weren't that strong when I went down. Wow, look at that. Amazing. There we go. Who could have thought that today would have ended like this at four o'clock? And I was round there and it was blowing a gale. Well, not blowing a gale, but blowing a, it was a, a full on force four. Horrible. And then within half an hour, it's just dropped off. You just, just shows you. You just cannot predict. I'll second guess anything. Now then, look at that. Landwin Island does in fact look like an island. And in fact it isn't really. If I didn't know better, I'd paddle over there and think I'll get through the gap instead of going round. What time is it? 8.12. I've got about 50 minutes before it goes dark. Wonderful. Well, I have really enjoyed this afternoon. Yep, it does look like you could get through that gap. Well, I'm absolutely sure you can't. Except on a really big spring tide. Well, I've had a look at these two through the binoculars and it looks like there's water right through. It looks like they've paddled through. Which is news to me. Because I thought this wasn't an island, I'm only on the biggest tides. And I'm sure it ain't the biggest of tides. Oh, well, that sure was a big tide the other day. Yesterday, they were coming back from the scary. By God. I've just had a look at, through the binoculars at them people, and it definitely looks like they're wading through the water. That sure will be one big shortcut for me. Well, 8.30, five minutes after I said I'd find out in five minutes, I was right. I was right, it is a wash. Well, I've been here umpteen times and I've never seen it a wash like this. So Landwin Island is truly an island. I thought it was only an island in exceptional tides. Well, I absolutely cannot believe it. I don't know how many times I've been here. I don't know, 10, 20 times. Sometimes I've been on foot with dog. Sometimes I've been on powerboat. I've been on 
kayak umpteen times. Never seen this a wash like this. I don't want one of them coming through well. I'm gonna put this camera away. I ain't risking that. I'm not entirely sure that I'm gonna get through. Camera away. My god, that was close. I actually scraped a touch bottom. There's some really jagged drops there. I really got away with that. Oh, oh my God. Look how shallow it is. Thought it only just made it as an island. Bleeding now, I was lucky there. Really, really lucky. God, it's absolutely teeming with fish in these shallows here now. Look at them all. It's teeming with them. Look at them on our surface. Oof. I don't know if the camera can see them or not. It's absolutely chock full of sand eels. They might even be white bait actually. There's loads of them. Well, it's less for me to drag it up the beach, but that's not the problem. That's the easy bit on this beach. Getting it up in that soft sand is the killer. Well, I've never seen the tide this high here. Some sea kayaker camping out are they look it's another 10 mile trip I've never seen this tide as high here all these times I've been coming here never seen it as high it must be a spring tide then Ten point not one miles Someone has kindly lit a fire so that we know where the exit to the beach is. Oh no, that's not it, it's further on. I can see. There's that platform, that viewing platform, it's a bit further on. Bloody hell, I can smell barbecues and that, Jesus. Well, this has been a most amazing, enjoyable trip. Really has been good. It started off abysmally. We cut it all out, Landwin Island. All the up it would have been dark anyway, we wouldn't have been able to see most of it. People are enjoying themselves at this time of night. Oh, them barbecues smell good. Whew. Look at that, there's no surf anywhere along that beach except the bit now where we want to get off. Well, I'm not bothered now if I get wet. I'm already pissed wet, so do your worst. Let's see what happens. Is it where I get off?